This is chapter 1 entitled The IoT Under Attack. In this chapter, uh, we'll explain the need for IoT security in several IoT environments. We'll explain why security should be a focus of the IoT. We'll explain how the unique security risks of the IoT differ from the standard IoT security. We'll evaluate potential risks in various IoT use cases, explain the unique security requirements of the IoT in the smart home, and explain the unique security requirements of the IoT in healthcare. IoT Security Challenges Describing the world where everything's connected will be a little bit like trying to describe the internet in 1985. One of the current examples is LG. LG is able to redefine the boundary of IoT. Its refrigerator door is equipped with a WebOS digital display which allows consumers to even place orders from Amazon Shopping or listen to music. So through the constant innovation, we have opportunity to stitch that information together and predict consumers' needs and predict the information of which they might be searching for. In this video, shows how important is IoT security. Opticon created a car that drives itself by an attacker getting through their data using a thermostat. Even though Opticon has scanned their whole network, they forgot their thermostat which is inside their firewall and it is connected to Opticon's entire network. This allows the attacker to destroy its data and backup and then sell the blueprints to Opticon's competitor. Organizations often have two distinct networking domains that can be summarized as information technology and operational technology. IT includes devices in the data center, in the cloud, bring your own device, and thousands of sensors and actuators connected in the field. OT includes the industrial control systems, supervisory control and data acquisition systems, and all the devices that connect to these systems. The world of manufacturing is changing. By converging IT and OT, operations managers use IT tools to sift through the reams of operational data and make real-time decisions. IT teams can also use this data to do innovative things such as improving the supply chain and reducing downtime. In addition to IT and OT, we have consumer technology, which includes connected devices in the home, wearable technology, smart cars, and more. New device types and increasing number of devices per person all add up to a significant portion of connected devices in the age of IoT. In 2016, internet traffic from city devices was 61% of all IP traffic. Of all the city traffic, 81% of it was video traffic. This figure is a conceptual model for IoT security. Whether the IoT device belongs to IT, OT, CT, or some combination of the three, strong security is required. Service providers are those organizations that connect our devices to the internet. As such, they are in a position to offer services to address the IoT security needs of their clients. A smart home is an example of how the IoT is transforming the way we live, work, and play. Smart home devices include anything that can be remotely monitored and controlled. Its security measures include strong authentication, software upgrade, WPA2, and encryption. This discussion will provide an explanation of IoT healthcare use cases, vulnerabilities, risk, and mitigation. This video shows how Cisco provides comprehensive solutions for implementing the IoT in healthcare, such as for productivity, security breaches, and compliance issues. Fitness devices are among the most popular commercial IoT products. Some of these devices communicate with the cloud application. They use a Bluetooth connection to a phone and a cellular data or Wi-Fi connection to the internet and cloud, as shown in the figure. They come in many forms, such as a wristwatch, headband, helmet, or headphones. They usually consist of a sensor that can detect your heart rate and an accelerometer that detects motion in the form of steps. Some include more advanced features, such as location services using a GPS sensor, sleep monitoring, and enhanced application features. A cloud application enables 
storage of personal fitness data, an analysis dashboard, and a wide range of configuration settings. One function of IoT devices is healthcare monitoring, which involves the collection and evaluation of patient data over a period of time. The IoT has enabled real-time remote patient monitoring, or RPM. Patients who do not require direct observation by healthcare professionals in a clinical setting can be monitored at home. Monitoring devices can be worn by the patient and connected to the internet. The gateway combines signals from the sensors and submits the monitoring data securely over the internet to cloud applications. If the data reveals concerns about the patient's health, applications can promptly notify healthcare personnel, enable communication with the patient, and even call for emergency medical assistance. An RPM system is shown in the figure. A patient is wearing a number of different sensors to form a body sensor network or BSN, that collects information such as heart rate, body temperature, and blood oxygen levels. A gateway device, which, in, which can also be worn, connects the BSN to the monitoring platform across the internet. In a clinical setting, as many as 20 medical devices can be found in a single hospital room. The IoT provides various functionalities to connected medical devices. Aside from monitoring and submitting patient data, IoT sensors can be used to track the location of these devices. It is estimated that healthcare personnel can spend up to 25% of their time searching for medical devices that are required for patient care. Asset tracking through the use of the network can greatly enhance operational efficiency. IoT sensors also monitor device operation in order to detect problems and help prevent device failure. For example, therapeutic devices use actuators that are controlled by software to regulate the administration of drugs, fluids, and oxygen. Such devices can be monitored and controlled from a central location rather than by personnel who must go to the device. The use of the IoT in healthcare adds great efficiency to operations, but also adds challenges for IT departments and data security professionals. In August of 2017, the United States FDA approved a software update that will patch the security flaw in radio frequency enabled implantable cardiac pacemakers. The pacemakers are surgically implanted in the patient's chest in order to help control the beating of the patient's heart. The devices include an embedded microprocessor and firmware that is vulnerable to remote attacks over radio frequency. An attack on the pacemaker could result in the death of the patient. Fortunately, the firmware update could be made over RF without requiring removal or replacement of the device. It is estimated that 465,000 devices were affected. Potential vulnerabilities range from weak or non-existent authentication, unsecured embedded server processes, and unnecessarily vulnerable applications that could be compromised due to user error. In fact, it has been found that healthcare personnel may use web clients running on medical devices and systems to surf the web and read email, making these critically important devices vulnerable to the same attacks as many computers. Because many medical devices have a long period of use, the computers used to operate them are often running old and unpatched operating systems. Medical devices are poorly regulated and frequently not designed according to hardware and software security standards. Vulnerabilities in connected healthcare devices result in many risks. Vital therapies can be manipulated, interrupted, or disabled, resulting in patient injury or death. Less critical but very important are the risks that poor device security can pose to a patient data. Poor device security can allow a threat actor to access data that is stored on a connected healthcare device, or the device can provide access to data stored in the network. Personally identifiable information, or PII, about patients can be stolen or manipulated. Government regulations regarding the handling of PII can result in severe penalties to healthcare organizations if a data breach occurs. 
The best way to mitigate risk in healthcare IoT is to not put vulnerable devices on the network at all. Device manufacturers must design and build their devices with security in mind throughout the development lifecycle. Healthcare administrators must ensure the devices they purchase is secure and that device security has been adequately configured. IT personnel must provide a reliable means for updating and patching network attached devices. Network architectures should isolate data and control networks from maintenance, vendor, and asset location functionalities. Finally, all healthcare personnel must undergo training to build security awareness and create institutional values that embrace security in all aspects of healthcare network operation. This chapter began by discussing unsecured IoT devices. More devices are connecting to our networks every day. IoT devices are increasingly being compromised and used in a wide variety of attacks because they often lack critical device protections such as strong passwords, up-to-date operating systems, and segmented networks. Next, the chapter detailed the unique IoT risk. By converging IT and OT, operations managers use IT tools to sift through the reams of operational data and make real-time decisions. IT teams can also use this data to innovative things such as improving the supply chain and reducing downtime. The next section of this chapter covers the smart home IoT use case. The smart home is another example of how the IoT is transforming the way we live, work, and play. The next section discusses the healthcare IoT use case. Some fitness devices communicate with the cloud application. A cloud application enables storage of personal fitness data, an analysis dashboard, and a wide range of configuration settings. Patients who do not require a direct observation by healthcare professionals in a clinical setting can be monitored at home. Monitoring devices can be worn by a patient and connected to the internet. The use of the IoT in healthcare adds great efficiency to operations, but also adds challenges for IoT departments and data security professionals.